So, welcome back, or just a regular welcome if you're new here. It's been a very long time, but today I have exciting news. I am going to be unboxing my new travel bag. Here it is. It's from Base. Um, it's a company that I discovered on TikTok. And what I did not know is it's actually Shea Michelle's. Shea, no, it's not Shea Michelle. Shea, Shea Mitchell. It's her company. It's a luggage company. They do travel bags, work bags, um, little fanny packs. They just recently came out with a pet collection. I've been seeing it all over TikTok. I thought it was so cute, especially with the minimum color schemes that they have. Um, and then I was watching like a video on their website. It tells you like all about the bag and all that stuff. I was like, wait, that's Shay Mitchell. And you know, me and Shay Mitchell, we go way back. And by way back, I mean two weeks ago because I just started watching you. And so I was like, that's Peach. So yeah, I had to get it. Um, and yeah, so now we get to unbox it together and talk about it. And I'm super, super, super excited. Like I cannot wait to get to the airport for Thanksgiving and be here with my bag because I left my suitcase at home. <laughs> yeah anyways we don't even have to talk about it but yeah i left it at home so i got this instead and i'm so excited to have it so let's get right on into it so the first thing i want to talk about is when i purchased it i ordered it through the website um and the shipping time was amazing i did have a little bit of a pickle with it i was kind of upset with shay i did not i never got a tracking info i never got the hey your order has shipped out hey your order has left the factory or whatever I never got anything I got my confirmation email that says you know what you received that says I bought it but I never got anything else outside of that and so Monday I ordered it on November 8th Monday November 15th I sent an email like hey wanted to know because the website says it should take same day shipping normal like if you order before 2 30 p.m it's the same day which I did but they also said give it one to two days if they have like a sale going on or it's holiday time which it is so I did and then I did the standard three to five shipping, which was like $10. So I did that and it was still Monday and I hadn't heard a word. So I was like, what happened, what happened? And they emailed me back the next day and they were like, oh, well, um, we're so sorry that happened, but it does say that it was delivered. And I was like, okay, because I ordered it to the dorm. And if you order it to the dorm, at least here, it goes like through the university mailing station and then disperses to like your specific dorm. And just, just my luck, like by coincidence, like an hour or so after I read that email Tuesday, I got another email saying my package was downstairs. So I went to go grab it and now it's here and I'm so, so, so excited. That took all of seven days, probably shorter, because she told me that UPS said it delivered November 12th. And so the university didn't get it to me until November 15th or, or 16th, whatever it was. Anyways, it was fast regardless. So happy about that. So. Let's get into it. So here it is. Oh gosh. So this is the mini Weekender. Um, the bag, this is one of their most popular bags. They have the Weekender and then the mini version. And it's kind of got some weight on it. I like that, it's heavy duty. Um, I got the mini version because I don't really need like a giant bag. I'm not that kind of girl. This is going to be like for carry-ons, um, weekend trips. I don't need like the big heavy duty weekender. I forget the measurements of that one, but it was maybe about a couple inches bigger. So this one is 16 by 16 and then 8 inches deep, which is perfect for me. Like as you can see, I can carry this in the airport without looking too, you know, weighed down by my bags. Um, I got it in the beige color, but it comes in black, it comes in gray, they even have a plaid model, but I think that was limited edition. But either way, the aesthetic is cute, and all my friends um, laugh at me because they're like, the only thing I'm concerned about is with an aesthetic, and they're not wrong, but I think that's so fun, that's like, <laughs> that's like one of the best parts of buying stuff is making sure that it's cute. And this is very cute. So yes, size of it, 16 by 16, eight inches deep. And then you'll see right here at the bottom, this is detachable. It doesn't get better than this. This is something that you can put your shoes in and of course other stuff too, but it completely detaches. So if I don't want this, I can have just my bag. Amazing. This bag was $88 which was a little bit steep, but I think it was well worth it. I, I really do think I got a good quality product. And like I said, it's 16 by 16, eight inches deep. 
Um, you get three color options unless they have all, um, an additional limited edition color or things like that. And then plus I used a coupon. I got 20% off I think it was. Whatever promotional they were doing, I opted in and I got my little discount. Um, so I think the total with shipping and all that, it still ended up being $88. But yeah, so I, I do think it's definitely worth the buy. And look at the gold hardware. Look at that. Very nice, very sturdy. But let's talk business. So the first thing, actually I need scissors. Yeah, let's start on the outside then work our way in. So number one, the detachable compartment. It unzips like so. Yes, right here, and then it's got the mesh lining. You can put your shoes, swimsuits, whatever it is that you want to put in here. Um, it opens up. You can put a couple shoes in here. Let me grab some. So this compartment is lined with what I think is polyester. So if you spill something, shoes wet or muddy, you can just wipe it on out and it won't be that big of a deal. And then from there, you can have your bag. This is so cute. And then you have this zipper pocket, which goes pretty deep. It's only about six inches wide or so, I would say, but it goes relatively deep. And then on the back, you have your trolley pass-through, which also doubles as a pocket. So unzip it. You can put your little suitcase handle through here and wheel it. Zip it up. It's a pocket. Then it's got these faux leather straps. I doubt this is real leather. Or is it? I'll fact check myself. But um, you open it up. I love this hardware. I really do. You open up the bag and boom. And it's got, it's something in here that makes it sturdy when you open it up. But you can see right off the bat your laptop folder, which is definitely a must. And then you can slip some other, you can slip some other stuff in here. Whatever it is you choose to fill your bag with. If you're anything like me, you'll put anything and everything. And this one even has two more additional pockets right here. Pocket one, pocket two. Slide some stuff in here. Then in the back, it's got your straps. So if you want to wear it as a crossbody or across your body um, or extend it on your shoulders, you can do that. I probably won't do that. Um, I'm not tall enough to be doing all that. Sometimes it makes the bag just hit a little too low. I don't like that. Um, another pocket over here. Another zipper pocket right here too. So yeah, 16 by 16, 8 inches deep. I'm going to pack this bag and show y'all what you can fit in here. Um, but I like it. I really love it. So it's got plenty of zippers and compartments for you to slip everything in. And this, I also love this part. It's got a key fob. Love the attention to detail because I have a tote bag that I use pretty regularly. The way I lose my keys all the time and have to dig in the bottom of the bag is so irritating. But to be able to clip them right here, even clip on your little AirPods right here and just whip it on out when you need it. And I think this is the perfect weekend size. Had I got the, um, the real version instead of the mini version, I think I would have been a little unsatisfied because I don't need that much stuff. I don't pack, that's not true. I was gonna say I don't pack heavily, but that's not true. But if I know I'm gonna be gone for a short time, then yeah, it doesn't matter. And on top of that, the inside of this is also lined with polyester. So of course, if you spill it or waste anything, you should be good. Um, this is, I want to say canvas. It's cotton 100%, but I, I don't know. I like it. A lot of people were concerned about damaging it and staining it, you know, but just spot treat it according to, yeah. So to clean it, the outside, you can fully wipe it down if you need to. Um, but or the inside rather but the outside they recommend you spot treat it but i'm really 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 satisfied with this bag i love it that's 88 dollars i ever spent uh, shane mitchell will be seeing me again and on top of everything else this is definitely carry-on size i'm willing to bet this is also personal item size like you can slide this under your seat um it's not that big at all but it's still big enough where you can handle your business and pack stuff um, so you can definitely bring this on a carry-on. I'm just, I love it. I really do. So very quickly, I wanted to show you guys how I packed it up. I ended up with three sweaters, two jeans, a pair of leggings, no, actually two pair of leggings, 
uh, my laptop, my notebook, and my camera, a book, and my keys. And I put some more stuff in the pockets afterwards, but I really got a good bit of clothes in here and I'm really satisfied with it. I think it's the perfect size for weekend trips where you don't need too much, just maybe about three outfits, maybe even four depending on the season. And yeah, that was it. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that in that detachable shoe compartment, I did include two pairs of shoes, which were my high top Converse and a pair of tennis shoes. Overall, I would say I would definitely be getting a lot of good use out of this bag, taking a lot of weekend trips. Um, this is so efficient for carry-on purposes. This is just a good, high quality bag so if you have any more questions leave them down below if not that's it for me um very satisfied very much in love with this bag and with that being said i'll see you guys in the next video oh.